Taylor Uthi, and she's going to talk to us about what advice she has for underclassmen. Um, time really does go by fast, so always work your hardest, have fun, and do your best. And what activity in high school have you enjoyed the most? I think sports is probably the activity that I've enjoyed the most. You learn so much from them. You learn how to be a good leader. And you just learn to work with people. All right. And, what, and Taylor, what does it mean to be a Wildcat to you? Being a Wildcat means just always doing your best, being respectful of other people, and honoring your school name in a respectful manner. Good luck, football boys. <laughs> Gatlin today and he's going to tell me what it means to be a wildcat. Yeah. Um, I think being a wildcat is someone who shows trustworthiness and shows respect, has school spirit and goes to all the events. Has a great time doing it. And Gatlin, what is your advice to the underclassmen? Stay in school. Gatlin, can you tell me why you feel it's an honor to be selected as a candidate? Well, I'm honored that the staff thinks of me as a representative of the school. And I like that they appreciate the work I do. It truly is an honor. I'm here with Emma Rang, and she's going to talk to us today about what it means to be a wildcat. Um, being a Wildcat is more than just taking your academic classes. It's learning how to be a, a good person in general. Um, you'll learn the values of like a tight-knit community and getting to know people around you and knowing that someone always has your back. What has high school meant to you, Emma? Um, you learn a lot in high school. Um, you get to learn about responsibility and friendships and just learning to be a good person. So what's a valuable lesson you've learned while you've been at Riceville? Um, I've learned to always be yourself and accept other people for who they are. Don't worry about the small stuff because everything ends up working out okay in the end. Thanks, Emma. Yep. It's a great day to be a Wildcat. Always is. I'm here with Nate Miller today, and he's going to talk to us about what it means to be a Wildcat. Um, growing up being a Wildcat ever since kindergarten, it's just something you just have a lot of pride being a Wildcat. You grow up watching the football games, going to all the sporting events. You just like representing that red and black. It's just something you feel kind of inside of you. Like you just enjoy it. You're excited to go to everything that you can, and. It's just something special to be a Wildcat. And do you have anything valuable that you've learned while you've been here in Riceville schools? Um, yeah, there's lots you learn here at Riceville. Mostly the atmosphere that you grow up around with all the people knowing you, you knowing everyone. You get to like, it's a family atmosphere here, and it's just good to be around people like that. So it's a great day to be a Wildcat. It's always a great day to be a Wildcat. Thanks, Nate. Yep. with Hannah and she's going to talk to us about what advice she has for underclassmen. My advice for underclassmen would be to always have fun with everything that you do, be a leader in all the activities that you're in, and take life as it comes because uh, high school is going to go by really fast. How about what activity in high school have you enjoyed the most? My activity that I probably enjoyed the most was beach because I got to go to different schools and meet lots of people and every time I go back I get to see them and we always get to talk about what's been going on and watch each other perform. And, yeah. Okay and what does it mean to be a wildcat to you Hannah? To me being a wildcat means being a close family because I don't have any siblings so I pre pretty much consider all my classmates my siblings and getting along 
together well and being involved in as much as you can. It's a great day to be a wildcat, right? Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Hannah. <laughs>today and he's going to talk to us about what activity he's enjoyed the most here at school. Uh, I'd say all the sports because you learn leadership and responsibility and it's uh, kind of like a second family. It's pretty nice, right? Yeah. How about why is it an honor for you to be a candidate? Uh, all my other siblings were on the homecoming course so it's just kind of nice to be like them and get on. It's been a pretty nice honor, right? Yeah. And what does it mean to be a Wildcat? Uh, be a Wildcat means I have good school spirit, go to the athletic events and cheer on your school and just be proud to be a Wildcat. It's a great day to be a Wildcat. Yes, it is. Thanks, Jake. Kayla, and she's going to talk to us about what advice she has for underclassmen. My advice for underclassmen is to enjoy every minute of it. High school goes by so fast, so make the best memories that you can. Nice. And what activity have you enjoyed the most in high school? Um, all the sports that I've been involved, involved in. Um, I've been active in everything, and it's a lot of fun being with your team and being a leader. They're like another family. Very good. And what does it mean to be a wildcat? Being a wildcat means a lot. You have school spirit and everyone knows everyone with being a small school. And yeah. So it's a great day to be a wildcat. It is. All right. Thanks, Michaela. Hi, John. Hello. Can you tell me what it means to be a Wildcat? Uh, it means to have pride and school spirit and to support Riceville in academic, extracurricular, and athletics. Thanks, John. Yep. John, what's your advice to the underclassmen? My advice would be to have fun while you're in school and enjoy the fact that you don't have to go to like an eight-hour job every day and you get to see your friends all the time but also to take your coursework seriously and to learn as much as you can because that's the reason why you go to school. What activity have you enjoyed the most while at Riceville, John? Uh, that would have to be FFA because through the last three years I've been three different officers and I've really learned some skills when it comes to like a leadership and like people under you and you have to take charge and whatnot. And I also got to compete in some competitions like conduct of meetings and parliamentary procedure which if you're going to have like a meeting or you're in some group, you got to have a general knowledge of that. And then like soils, egg mechanics, and farm business management, it kind of gives me a little tidbit of like what it's about. And I want to go into uh, agriculture in the future, and I'll see, I'll see an interest in them, and maybe I can look further into it and see what I want to do for the rest of my life. What? Bleh, 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 i got to start over. What activity? <laughs> <laughs> to you, Taylor. Um, being a wildcat means just. Oh gosh, no. <laughs> <laughs> to always know that. I have no idea. <laughs>